So now that you've gone 12 rounds with Floyd Mayweather, yeah. who says he's the best ever, uh, you know, I know you know your boxing. Uh, how, how great do you think that Floyd Mayweather is? He, I mean, compared to the guys you've watched and, uh, and I mean, he's sharp, but Thank you. you know, it's hard for me to say that because I haven't been in the ring with Muhammad Ali. I haven't been in the ring with Rocky Marciano, you know, those guys. But like I said, you know, as of right now, um, you know, to be, was he 38 now? Like to be 38 years old, man, and 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 still have, and still have that speed, and still have that timing, um, you know, it's unheard of, you know what I mean? So, um, you know, so I, you know, definitely commend him for that, you know, for sure to just have like the run that he's had for 19 years, um, you know, just being world champion and continue to, you know, move forward toward greatness. So, so I gotta commend him for that. At the end of the day. You know, it doesn't matter what our issue is or whatever the case is outside the ring. You know, as a fighter, um, you know, like I said at the press conference, like, you know, not too many people can do this. Not too many people can make that long walk to that ring. Not too many people can just go in the ring, just fight somebody they don't even know in front of you know, thousands of people. You know what I mean? That's some backyard type shit. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 um, and like I say, he showed, you know, 19 years, he was able to do it and stay undefeated. So I got to commend him for that. Andre, I mean, you, saw, you were in there tonight with him. I mean, what's your opinion of his talk of retirement? I mean, should he retire given the skill level that you saw him at tonight? I mean, you know, like I said, I mean, it's up to him. You know, I'm not, you know, I'm not Floyd. You know what I mean? It, you know, he's done the young... I believe he's done tremendous things for the sport. You know, he's accomplished, you know, some of everything. You know, he's broken all the records, made a shitload of money. So if he wants to retire, he can do whatever he wants to do, man. He has a tremendous family. He has a tremendous team. And, and you know, he's been, you know, holding them, you know, on his back for the last couple of years. So, you know, I'm not here to say if a man should, should retire or keep on going. You know what I'm saying? I mean... You know, you know I mean, this sport is, you know, it's brutal by itself. You know, he put in a lot of work. You know what I mean? So if he wants to retire, I mean, he should be able to. If he wants to come back, you know, I mean, that's on him as well. But, you know, if he does, you know, you got to respect that. It's, you know, you know, too many people are questioning that. You know, like a guy, like I say, a guy put in, you know, I don't know, you know, 20, you know, 30 some odd years, you know, you know, I hear, you know, busting his ass, running, and, you know, training, fighting. And at the same time, you know, being able to stay undefeated and take care of all of these damn people, he should be able to do what the hell he want to do. <laughs> For real, straight up. Hey, Andre. Yeah. Uh, did you feel that the fight was closer than what the scorecard suggested? Yeah, I believe so, but you know it is what it is, man. I'm, yeah, you know, like I said, I'm here. Yeah, I'm in his hometown, and uh, you know it was a lot that was on the line tonight for him. So, you know, of course I knew that the scores were a lot closer, but like I said, it is what it is, man. Like I said, he deserves everything he's, you know, I mean he got tonight. Andre, right here in front. Hi. What will you personally take from this entire experience? of having participated in this fight with Mayweather? Yeah, I mean, just everything, man. Just the whole experience is just, was just amazing for me. You know, this is a situation that, that all, you know, us as young kids, you know, coming into sport, you know, we dream of to be here at a big ass press conference with all these cameras in your face. And, and, and you know what I mean? you know, fighting on pay-per-view. I mean, ain't nothing like it, you know what I mean? So I, now I can't look at the situation and, 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 and just, you know, think it was a bad situation for me. You know what I mean? Like coming from where I come from, you know, like we've always been underdogs. You know what I mean? We're not, we're not known to make it out. I mean, I got my whole family here and we was here to be able to put on a tremendous performance tonight. Um, you know, so I got to be happy because of that, for sure.